In this tutorial, we are going to talk about preparing your 3D design in SimLab Composer to be displayed in the SimLab VR Viewer. From the File menu, select Import. As you can see, SimLab Composer supports a huge variety of 3D formats that can be imported for all purposes, and in this case to view in VR. Select the file and click Open. The 3D design is loaded in SimLab Composer and it has textures and default materials applied to it. Click on the workbench icon and select the VR workbench. The VR workbench contains the basic tools that are found in the scene building workbench, along with the animation workbench, since those tools can prove useful in preparing your scene for virtual reality viewing. Aside from the Composer tools, you will find the Launch VR menu, where you can export your design as a 3D VR file format, or you can directly run the design in either desktop or VR mode. In the Visual Effects menu, you'll be able to create various dynamic visual elements that can further improve the realism in the VR experience. In the VR Actions menu, you can manage VR docks and grabbable objects, and the Viewer Start button will determine the starting location of your camera in the VR experience. Click on Viewer Start. A human model is now loaded into the scene. This human will represent the viewer during the VR experience. To quickly position where the viewer starts, press N on your keyboard, then click on the ground to snap the character to the desired location. You can then rotate the character to determine the angle at which the viewer will start. Go to the Launch VR menu and select Start Desktop. The Desktop Viewer is an essential tool where you can examine the VR experience without having to use the VR head mount display and controllers each time you need to test the scene out, or in the case of not having a VR setup on the machine you are using. You can now navigate through the scene in the Desktop Viewer using the mouse and keyboard and you can assess the overall VR experience for further modifications and improvements. Press Escape to exit SimLab Viewer and go back to SimLab Composer. You can now begin adjusting and modifying the materials in the scene. Click on the ground, and in the Material Attributes panel to the right, set the material type to plastic, and increase the roughness slightly. You can also apply materials from the material library simply by dragging a material onto an object. You can also modify the newly added material by changing the parameters in the Material Attributes panel. You can also import additional models to the scene. It can be a model you created or an asset that can be found in the 3D Models Library. Let's add a chandelier to the scene for additional lighting. Place it on the ceiling using the N key which will snap the light to the location where you clicked. Click on Environment from the Object Tree panel to the left to access the Sun and Sky attributes. In the Sun Attributes panel, you can determine the angle at which the sun rays will be cast in the scene, as well as the sun strength which controls the brightness of the sun rays. The sky strength will control the ambient light, which will determine the overall brightness of the scene. You can visit simlabsoft.com for more tutorials and guides on material management and lighting. Once you're satisfied with the adjustments you made, go to the Launch VR menu and click on Start Desktop.
SimLab VR is an ever-evolving, sophisticated technology that allows you to demonstrate and share your design in a revolutionary and efficient way. Aided by the enormous capabilities of SimLab Composer, turning your 3D design into a rich VR environment is a few steps ahead.